Hola, it's Senora Huey, and it's time for Spanish. Okay, first of all, class A, you have to get warmed up with the Buenos Dias, Buenas Tardes, Buenas Noches song, okay? You just know it off the top of your head. Let's go. Buenos Dias, Buenos Dias, ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien, gracias, muy bien, gracias. Y usted, y usted, and what's the one next? Uh -huh. Buenas tardes, buenas tardes, ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien, gracias, muy bien, gracias. Y usted, y usted. And the next one is, buenas noches, buenas noches, ¿Cómo estás? ¿Cómo estás? Muy bien, gracias, muy bien, gracias. Y usted, y usted. Ole, we're ready. Now, ¿Qué mes es? Es el mes de, aunque okay, casi repita, es el mes de abril, casi, hola, abril. So you know what the month it is, right? It's el mes de abril, okay? And what year is this? Que año está? 2024. So 20 is what? 20. And 24 is what? 24. Okay, and what day is it? Friday. Viernes, casi. El, ese es. We we'll said the date is. I'm going to ask you, casi. ¿Cuál es la fecha? What is the date? ¿Cuál es la fecha? You're going to say, Es el viernes, it is Friday. Es el viernes, the 19th of May. El 19 de, I'm sorry, of April, de abril in the year 2024, 20, 24. Now, they're practicing those days. All right, class A, ¿cuál es la fecha? You're going to say what? Es viernes, it's Friday. For el, es viernes, the day is what? The 19th. El 19 de, the month? Abril, and que año, what year? 20, 24. You have to practice that, okay? Because it gets more difficult as you go, okay? The 31, I just gave you 19, 10 in the web, and more bien. So now that you know, okay, the date, you know, the month is Abril. So Abril, we just said that. And que, uh, que estacion? La estacion, what season is this? You got a poem to do about seasons anyway. Class A, what's this? La what? La primavera. All right, now there's some things in this picture you're going to see in a minute. Okay, look at this picture very, very carefully, all right? All right, what you see in here, you're going to see it in a minute, separated. All right, class A, la primavera. Muy bien. So something that I picked up from that picture would be the, the mariposas, las mariposas. Okay, class A, el foto, the picture has, el foto, el foto tiene las mariposas. The picture has butterflies. El foto tiene las mariposas. It has butterflies. Also. También, look at it one more time. Let me look at it one more time. All right, so we said the mariposas. We see them. There they go. They're nice, beautiful. Ah, tan bonita. And something else you have on here, okay, other than the what? Mariposas, okay? And I picked out this one. It also has what? Las flores. El foto. El foto tiene las flores también. The picture also has what? Flowers, okay? El foto tiene las flores también. So it has. El foto tiene las flores también. Mm? Muy bien. Bueno, durante esta estación, during this season, it's, it's just coming in slowly, but it's getting there. So what did you see recently? Mm-hmm. You had this. I didn't bring up the moon. I'm talking about the sun. I say what? El sol. Now, this sun is shining. El sol brilla. El sol brilla. This sun is laughing or smiling. El sol sonríe. All right, el sol sonríe, it's smiling, okay? Muy bien. Now, if you see el sol, then this is what you're going to probably have to say. If you're in the summer, anyway, you're going to say what? Hace calor. It's hot. Hace calor. Hmm? Hace calor. Now, because you are the fourth and fifth graders, I know you know your days and months well. So now we're going to do it, sing the song, and we'll take about maybe one minute and a half. Mm, maybe two. Let's go. I'll just say the word in English and you just say the word in Spanish. Class A, the word for Monday, because you know the Spanish week starts on Monday, okay? Ends on Sunday. So what's the Spanish week? So we'll start with Monday. What is it? Lunes, Tuesday. Martes, Wednesday. Miércoles, Thursday. Jueves, and for you today, it should be on what? Friday? It should be what? Viernes, excelente. Then comes sábado. Then domingo, okay? So then we say la semana. So we're going to say Monday and Tuesday, repeat. Lunes y martes. Then we say 
Wednesday and Thursday. Me read. Miércoles y jueves. Hmm? Then we say Friday and Saturday. Viernes y sábado. Then we say Sunday the week. Domingo la semana. Let's do a quick song. Let's go. Lunes y martes, miércoles y jueves, viernes y sábado, domingo la semana. On one breath. Uno respira. Try it again. Lunes y martes, miércoles y jueves, viernes y sábado, domingo la semana. And you can also sing it in English. Monday and Tuesday, Wednesday and Thursday, Friday and Saturday, Sunday the week. Muy bien. Now for the 12 meses, the 12 months. January. Enero. February. Febrero. March. Marzo. April. Abril. May. Mayo, June, Junio, like you need Junio, July, Julio, Julio, August, Agosto, September, Septiembre, October, Octubre and November. Noviembre. And last one is going to be December. Diciembre. You will note that I have all capital letters or I have all small letters. In Spanish, days and months are not considered, you know, proper nouns. So we say that we have to just do regular. Either they're all capital, either all lowercase. Muy bien. Excellent thing. Now, here's your poem. It's about the seasons. You know this. It's very simple. Just to make you speak a little bit of Spanish fluently. Let's repeat it. Las, las estaciones del año. The seasons of the year. Las estaciones del año. First of all, the first one's pronounced what? Verano. So, what season? Look at the picture there. You can almost tell small. Las de verano is going to be what season? Uh huh. The summertime. Next one. Otoño, that is the autumn. Then you have invierno. Which one is that? That's the winter. And last one you have is what? Primavera. That's the spring. Here's your poem. Now, on this side, you're going to see the Spanish. We'll read this together. And this side, you can always see what you're saying in English, okay? Okay, you're going to say, Me gusta sembrar. Me gusta sembrar. Say that. Okay? So you have here right here, I like to plant, I like to plant. So sembrar means to plant. Me gusta sembrar, me gusta sembrar en la primavera. Me gusta sembrar. When do you like to plant it? In what season? In the what? Springtime. So it's right here. I what? It says what? In what? The springtime. I like to plant. Next we have, me gusta nadar. Me gusta nadar. En el verano, me gusta nadar. So you like to what? Swim, okay? So you're going to swim in the summertime. So you like swimming in the summertime. Next one. Me gusta estudiar, right? Me gusta estudiar. Me gusta estudiar. En el otoño, me gusta estudiar. So... Otoño is uh, what season? The fall. Estudiar means the study, right? You got it. So you're going back to school. So therefore, it's in the what? In the fall, I like to study. And the last one, me gusta patinar. Me gusta patinar. En el invierno, me gusta patinar. Now that's for us. We don't do a lot of ice skating, but patinar is the ice skating, okay? Okay, class. Oh, it could be any kind of skating, really, the patinar. Mm hmm. Clase so se me gusta patinar. So this way, in what season do you like to patinar? In el what? In Vietnam, in the wintertime, ice skating, okay? Then at the end, it says, here, clase, me gusta cantar, me gusta cantar. You like to do what? You like to sing in all the seasons you can sing, in todos los estaciones. Muy bien? All right.
Okay, here's your task. We have 66, 66 libros de la Biblia de Aprender. We have 66 books of the Bible to learn. And we're working on the Nuevo Testamento. We're working on the New Testament right now. So I'm going to send this to you, okay? And so you'll be able to see it, not this week, but next week, okay? But I will send you those in English first. So you can look at them. And these are telling you why. They're in color to tell you what they stand for. Some stand for the law, the history, the major prophets. So you can kind of look at what's going on. So you're going to have this class, eh? And this is your English ones, okay? You can check them off as you get it. Like take the first column first, learn that one. Then you might take the second column until you get to what? The New Testament. Then you stop. So we have 39 in the what? New Testament, I think, in the way, babe. And we have 27, 27 in, in the Old Testament, I'm sorry. And 27 in the New Testament, right? So you can learn them all, okay? And you're going to be the, the same one behind the other. Do I know, man? Aprendo. I'm learning. Hmm? Muy bien. So let's say them all first. Okay? And we've looked at, we're going all the way from the New Testament now. We did, we'll start from May 1st, first week in May. We're going to start the Old Testament. I mean, the New Testament, the Old Testament first. Well, that's the longest one, 39. Right in the way. All right, here we go. Class A, you want to say for me? Libros del Antiguo Testamento. Libros del Antiguo Testamento. Books of the Old Testament. Mm -hmm. And the first one we know, Class A, is in Espanol, Genesis. Exodo. Levitico. Números. Deuteronomio. Josué, Jueces, Ruth, yeah, first and second, Primer y Segundo Samuel, Primer y Segundo Samuel. All right. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's see. We're going to practice on next one. Then we have here, Primer y Segundo Reyes. Then you have, Primer y Segundo Crónicas, Esdras. Nehemias. In Spanish, you don't pronounce H, okay? If I say Nehemias, it's ne, not Nehe, Nehemias, okay? Here, Esther, Job, Salmos, Proverbios, Ecclesiastes, Ecclesiastes, muy bien, and Cantares, Cantares. All right, next one. I'm talking my mind as well. All right, next one, here we go. Isaías. Jeremías, Lamentaciones, is first one right? Ezequiel, Daniel, Oseas, see, Oseas, Oseas, Joel, because the J sounds like H, okay? Joel, Amos, Adias, Abdias, Abdias, then what? Jonas. Oh, nice. All right, almost there. Last one. Mikena. Then you have Naum. Nahaba. Ah, Abaku. Then you have Sophanias. Then, no H. Ajeo. Then what? Zacarias. And then what? Malak. Kias. Los libros del Antiguo Testamento. Are you ready? Let's do it. All right, we're going to do just two, the first two ones, all right, for two pages, and we'll do those again to the end of April. Then I'll have to bring the next 27. All right, here we go. You got to see it. Let's practice in them, okay? Here we go. Genesis, Éxodo, Levítico, Números, Deuteronomio. Josué, Jueces, Ruth, Primer y Segundo Samuel. Give a little beat to it when you get to it. You can make sure you remember. All right? Get a little going. Primer y Segundo Reyes. Primer y Segundo Crónicas. Estras. Nehemías. Esther. Job, Salmos, Proverbios, Ecclesiastes, Cantares. All right, that's it. That's it. Those two now, give it right. We'll do it. Okay, we'll do some more. No problem. We'll do some more. I know you want to do more. Let's go. Let's keep going. One more time. 
Isaías. Isaías, accedía, ¿ok? Eramías. Lamentaciones. Ezequiel. Daniel. Oseas. Joel. Amos. Abdias. Jonás. Miqueas. Naum. Sofanías. Abacuc. Ageo. Zacarías. Malaquías. Ole, clase, you said them all for the, what? Los libros del Antiguo Testamento. We need some more. Remember now, tell somebody this week or today, tomorrow, every day, say what? Jesus te ama. Jesus loves you. Adios. Practica.